Virgo, song that's playing for you is dope. So, we're talking about, look, you get into the money actually, you feel me? You done, look, you gave something up or somebody gave something up with you and it's like now that you did that, you get into the dough. You focused on your bread, whatever bread we talking about. Whether it's just like you in the internal bakery and you cooking up some new ideas on how you can express and or reach a goal and or point. Whether you trying to obtain and or participate something in something somewhere with someone or a group of someones. Or it's a situation where that's someone outside of you, someone outside of you probably gave something up with you. And it's like now they may be expressing and or communicating. It's like someone let go of the hurt, let go of the pain, or that was you. You may be in a position where you let go of the pain or the hurt a situation may have brought you. Whether that was a friendship, relationship, or just a way you were communicating yourself in a certain environment. And it's like you may not have been received the way you wanted to be received in that environment when you were communicating how yourself, how you were communicating, but at the same time, you not being received the way you wanted to be received brought you a new direction, a new emotional expression, a new idea, a new feeling. Whether that is you, someone outside of you. Play me, you know what I'm playing. Before you talk, raise up your hand. You need to give your running ears off. Commit me to the link. You need to scream. Money touch your hair really loud. Hey, you holding on to something there, Virgo? That's home. You 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 got your you holding on to your dough. <laughs> Whatever you got your mind on. If it ain't something tangible, like yo, you actually you stacking your bread, you got you a little business, you got you a little career going, whatever idea, whatever's working, or you holding on to that and it's like you not letting everybody get close to that. Whatever that is, you know, you might be, you might not be able to share this with everybody, whatever this is, whether this is just an ideal or just a realization you may have reached internally that, you know, not everybody going to understand this aspect of you, this per, this perspective or how you got here. But, you know, here is where you want to be. So you go on, you going to be here, whatever that means for you. Or it's just an idea you might be holding on to. And it's like, this it it this stemmed off of a, something you were already doing. And it's like, you, you ain't really let... You might not be in a position where you took an action regarding that idea, regarding that thought, but it's you holding on to it. You ain't letting that shit go. Yeah, shit, it might be cold where you at, though. Shit, not. If it ain't a situation where we talking about the fact that you holding on to your dough, because when it's real cold, it, 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 it's, it's real cold. Dip, dip is the song that's playing for you. Yeah, look, I don't know folks around you feeling the same way they used to feel about whatever they felt about. Whether that's you, you may be in a position where you once felt an overwhelming amount of emotion in a positive sense about a situation and when you involved yourself there it brought you life now it's almost like you you it, it's some holes in the boat the boat you trying to hold on to your belongings that you brought on ship on board and shit is just going down so if it ain't you feeling left out from a situation, relationship, or friendship, then it's someone outside of you. It's like they they feel real cold. You they you you ain't the same way with them how you used to be with them. You feel me? And it's and that's just because you're trying to hold on or you're holding on to this idea, whatever this is. And it's like you could be given a cold shoulder. Because you don't feel for that. You don't have feelings about that. Whatever that is. You, you look, you made a choice. No. And that's what, that is what you want to do. Whatever make you feel good. That's you holding on to. It's an idea. It's like, you may not be in a position where you can do. Because these ain't fall out. They's just on the bottom. It's like, you want that. But you still doing this. Whatever that means for you. Man, I love that bacon soda. 
Hey, Dip Dip is the song that's playing for you. Yeah, look, shit, damn, shit might be over. And what that luck, so you could do something new. These ain't fallouts, though. So that's it. I ain't even gonna say that's for you. That's what you thinking about, though. It could be what you thinking about. Because ain't nothing that shit came out. But they all there. It's like, this is kind of already done for you. This shit been done for you. Whatever that was, you don't. it don't bring you the same high it used to. Whatever that is for you. Whatever that means for you. Whether it's just a hobby you had or you was kicking it with some friends. You was kicking it with some family members. Or you was associating yourself with a person. And that person, you and this person, like last week, two weeks ago, two years ago, two days ago, two months ago. You feel me? Two seconds ago, you was feeling one way about it. You was all the way up. Every time y'all linked up, y'all got real high spiritually. You feel me? Or y'all actually, I could actually be on some shit like that. Laugh now. Cry later. You're in the later part. You was laughing back then, man. You ain't laughing no more. Oh, that's what somebody is with you. Somebody holding on. You, you look, penny pension. That could be somebody. Don't know this and all that. Well, yeah, you motherfuckers was real active yesterday. Now today, look, and ain't that some shit? The Wheel of Fortune. Ah, oh, look at that, that. Karma. That's all I can say to that one. You know what the fuck you, you did or what some, someone knows what they did to put themselves in a position to get a cold shoulder from you if you give them a cold shoulder. Now you holding back all your goods, all your ideas, all your communication, the minds and energies you used to share with these people or this person, you're not sharing them. Or that's you may be getting the cold shoulder. And that's your karma. I took a half and she took the whole thing. It's like you you were someone gave you an inch and you took a mile. Or someone might not even gave you anything and you just took the whole thing. It's like it was you were taking and it's like you were taking more than giving and now you can't take no more. Now there ain't shit to take. Look, you might you made the wrong decision when it came to you expressing or investing in something you actually wanted to do. And what it, whatever that means for you. Uh-huh. Hey, it's like and you may feel naked. Or you you exposed, but that's your karma to feel naked. When it comes to that it's like you can't defend yourself in whatever situation we're talking about. Where you thought if you carried a certain action, you would be burdenless. Now it's like now you just holding on to what you got, what you're building on. If it's someone outside of you, you hold, you're holding yourself away from someone or something or somewhere. You're not going there anymore. And there's trying to get you back, but there can't get you back because you know what there is now. It's almost like someone's mask fell off. Whether that was your mask or someone else outside of you's mask. And that was your karma for your actions. Whoever did it. Yeah, look, laugh now, cry later. Someone outside. It's like, if it's you, someone outside of you can't do shit but watch you have a good time. If it's some, if it's if it's you in a position where you watching someone outside of you celebrate an emotional investment or just like in their world in whatever context we talk about, it's like you feel left out from that. Whether because you were in it or you could have been in it. But now it's a ghost town. And hey, put your foot though. You know what that means. I still got one more for you. One more for you, Virgo. Yeah, hey, look, I tell you, the whole time you knew though, or if it ain't someone outside of you who know, you know. And that's why you, it's like you, you could be in a position where you dead, it, it's, there's some awareness in this atmosphere. Whatever involved, whatever you involved with, it's, there's some awareness, whether you know or someone outside of you know some shit. It both both parties or parties or just you 
if you're dealing with yourself, you know what the fuck is up. Or everyone knows what's up. Everyone knows. Just, and you know what that means for you. You know what that means for you. Put your foot. You know what's all right. <laughs>